HJK Infosys provides world class online IT training, staffing, and software testing solutions to customers worldwide. H2K Infosys supports 100% job oriented training, hands on project work, cloud test lab, resume preparation and review, mock interviews, robust syllabus, one time pay, lifetime access to live classes and videos. H2K Infosys has won the trust of thousands of students worldwide. For free demo class, visit h2kinfosys.com. The Comprehensive Guide to Manual Testing Unveiling the Depths of Software Quality Assurance Welcome, Tech Enthusiasts! Today, we are diving deep into the world of manual testing, an essential component of software quality assurance. In this video, we'll explore what manual testing is, its goals, types, the process involved, and the tools commonly used. So, let's get started. Goals of Manual Testing Immediate Goals Our immediate goals involve actively searching for and identifying any bugs within our systems. This process is crucial for ensuring the smooth operation and functionality of our products. Long-Term Goals Looking ahead, our focus extends to achieving and maintaining reliability, quality, and high levels of customer satisfaction. Additionally, we aim to proactively manage risks associated with our products, mitigating potential issues before they impact our users. Post-implementation goals After deployment, we focus on reducing maintenance costs, improving efficiency, and enhancing testing procedures for thorough system evaluation. Additionally, we prioritize bug prevention. Importance of manual testing why do we need manual testing? To prevent potential issues in the market, manual testing is essential to ensure software stability and quality. A defect-free application attracts more customers, making it a crucial step before the software is released. Types of manual testing Let's explore the various types of manual testing. White box testing conducted by developers involves testing every line of code for usability and design. Black box testing focuses on functionality without visibility into internal code. Integration testing checks interactions between integrated components. Acceptance testing performed by customers to certify system requirements before production. Unit testing validates individual modules or components. System testing tests the entire system to ensure it meets all required standards. Manual testing process. Requirement analysis. Explore the thorough examination of software requirements. Highlight the necessity for a comprehensive grasp of functionalities, features, and objectives. Demonstrate how requirement analysis serves as the foundation for crafting a robust test plan. Test Plan Creation Outline the essential components of a test plan, including testing approach, objectives, scope, resources, and schedules. Illustrate the process of formulating a test plan based on the insights gained from requirement analysis. Test Case Creation Test case creation in manual testing involves defining objectives, identifying scenarios, outlining steps and preconditions, and specifying expected results for comprehensive and effective software testing. Test case execution Explain the systematic execution of test cases aligned with the test plan. Describe the tester's role in executing tests and documenting results. Stress the importance of promptly recording any deviations from expected behavior. Defect logging Detail the process of logging identified discrepancies or defects during test case execution. Emphasize the thorough documentation of each defect, including comprehensive information. Highlight the pivotal role of a defect tracking system in managing and resolving issues effectively. Defect Fix Reverification 
discuss the steps involved in the development team's investigation and resolution of identified defects. Explain the process of re-verifying the defect fixes through the re-execution of relevant test cases. Underline the iterative nature of defect fixing and re-verification, crucial for enhancing software quality. Manual testing versus automated testing. Finally, let's compare manual testing and automated testing. Manual testing involves manual execution, while automated testing uses tools. Any application can be tested manually, but automated testing is beneficial for stable systems. Manual testing is time-consuming, while automated testing is time-efficient and cost-effective. Manual testing offers a more user-friendly interface, whereas automated testing may lack a friendly user experience. Manual testing is prone to human error, while automated testing boasts high accuracy. Manual testing can be boring and repetitive, whereas automated testing is less monotonous. In conclusion, manual testing is a vital process that demands creativity, patience, and an open mind. It ensures software quality from the end user's perspective, making it a crucial part of user-friendly software development. Thanks for joining us on this journey through the intricacies of manual testing. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech insights. Until next time, happy testing!